In the beginning, sports cars were only for the very rich. But after World War II, along came MG, and the not-so-very-rich discovered it. Today's MGB has rack and pinion steering, race season suspension, four-speed gearbox, and hefty 1798cc engine. A few reasons why the MGB is the most popular MG ever built. MG, the sports car America loved first. Way back in 1922, Kimber, whom Morris had installed as manager of the old Morris garages, had taken standard Cowleys and Oxfords and hotted them up for competition use. The cars were called after the firm, MG, Morris Garages. They were enormously successful among enthusiasts. But Morris knew his cars had built a reputation because they were cheap and reliable. Racing cars, then as now, are neither. Yet the achievements of the MGs could not be denied. In the event, Morris relented and cut the apron strings. MGs were given their own factory near Abingdon, where they were to develop their own distinctive breed and mystique. And now, at 6.5 a.m. on the 20th of August, 1951, the efforts of those Abingdon engineers reach their climax. He's off on his epic one-hour attempt. Fifteen laps around a ten-mile circuit, 5,400 revs per minute. Can he do it? One hundred and thirty-seven point four miles an hour. He's done it. See how a woman driver handles it. She'll never park it in a space like that. Nobody could. She'll never do it. Well, what do you know? Anyone can go shopping in the busiest of places with a motor car like this. Now what's she doing? That antique she's bought is worth close on $200, but she knows it'll sit there safe, thanks to this miracle new suspension. Yes? Snug as she is in this all-weather motor car of tomorrow that's been conceived today. This car, with perfect all-round vision, clings to the wettest and most slippery of surfaces. All the controls are in easy reach. The gear is where every motorist honestly wants it, and it's smooth and light. <laughs> 